Oh, I found this on the trending page. Not your typical camo. It sounds like very unoriginal, but I want to give it a shot because the towers are, well, a little different. We have anti balloon. So the only camo I'm noticing right now is Spirit of the Forest, but there's leads, and Spirit can't hit leads. And there's anti balloon ability, which hits camo. And I think that's it. Maybe Temple, but those are the two anti balloon and Spirit of the Forest. The thing is, do we even get the ability by the time the leads are out? Let's go. Um, I do beat the- yeah, I do beat the Cerams. Oh, I don't know though. The leads are really- they're pretty fast. Oh, I know, I have two Super Monkeys, so I get two abilities, so let's see. Temple. And balloon again. Wait, how did that- okay, I didn't catch that one for some reason. Guess you gotta put a little more- a little more central, right? Is this better? Let me get my temple ready, though. So wait for it. Last minute. Good. We got all of it this time. And then again. The money's perfectly there. If it works, it works. Let's see. First try, basically. Yeah, first try. Cool, I guess. But yeah, the answers were obvious because they literally only gave you the suggestions. They literally only gave you so many towers to choose from. And the camo options were... Pretty... They're right there. Okay, so we have a round 46 challenge. Um, 57-57. The trick is that we can sell, so uh, there might be a marker involved. But be aware of the max rigor rates. 2 HP on the Scrams. Well, 4, because fortified. Let me just see. Yeah, pretty slow, pretty slow. Now let's use the math. Walk in one shot. And not cause a farm. Because I need to skip the Scram layer. Or D-Camo, D-Regrow. First off, do I have D-Regrow? I do not. No Foam, no Druid. No, uh, no village. Now let's look for things I can one-shot from Ceram to Rainbow. Is there anything? There's Sniper. So I want to do three damage on the Cerams. So they're left with one HP. Uh, let me just try something really wacky. If they can all reach in range, I will... Ah, oh, I missed one. Two. Oh, that sucks. Let's try again. How do I evenly distribute six, one damage on everything? Maybe I have to wait for a better loop. Oh, I have an idea, I have an idea. So here's what I'm thinking. Uh, Sniper, Alpha buff. 2 zero, zero will will one-shot it. And then I can, like, like, if I drop it, obviously I'm gonna mess things up. So I don't want to drop it till the very end. I was hoping I'd do it the first lane, so I don't have to wait as long, but it's fine. I'll do it here, I'll do it here. So, do it slowly, three damage. There's, I missed one again, whatever. Let me just see if this concept works. I missed that one too. Okay, whatever. Maybe I'll do a Dark Monkey. Yay. The other one's a Lost Cause though, so. We hide it. And then we out buff. Don't buy- don't drop it yet though. Don't buy this until it gets in range. So I do this... now. One shot? One shot, one shot... no. So, I need 9 damage. I think the problem is that the 3 0, zero alpha up doesn't last the entire uptime. I don't know how to uh, manipulate that, but let me try again. Let's try this again. Okay, that's perfect. Not perfect, it's fine. I know that this has 2 HP, so 3 HP. 1. Perfect, now they're all 1 HP. Perfect. So I need to do 9 damage in one shot, so again, that would be what the sniper's for. But how do I make the alpha buff? Not be stupid. Can I straight up buy a, th a 4 zero, 0 I can, I can. Okay, awesome, awesome. So let me not upgrade this at all. Until it gets really close. In case you're wondering what I mean. Now? Okay. Please last. Don't time out, don't time out. It timed out on the very last one. Which is amazing. Okay, again. Good. Good. Freaking hell, I'm so bad. That's fine, that's actually perfect. I meant- I didn't mean to glue that, but that is actually good, because it snacks. Now they're all clumped together, which means I win. The problem before was that they were- the first one was two spaced apart, so I had to buy the outbuff early. But this way is different. Just to make sure, I got this, good. And win. Nice. Sure and sweet. So this is a 
Round 46 challenge. 120% Serum HP. And yeah, find two towers. That you can't sell. Let's do it. Yeah, how, how bad can it be? Well, for what I can tell, these options absolutely suck. Tier 2 towers. I do have an Alp buff, which is nice. Alp buff. So the Serams have 24 HP. They're slower, but... That's rough. Ninja and Cal No, no, Sentries. I know you can't Alp buff Sentries, but... I still think it might be good. Also this. New buff. Nail gun shots do extra damage to fortifieds. Does apply to Sentries. So if I Alp buff a 220 back here... I think I win. Also, Perishing Potions, half HP. I feel like this is good. Although the Rigor Rate is, is a bit... Um, uh, scary. I need Perishing to land. Probably should have put the uh, uh, Alpha Buff a little earlier in the track. Because this is too late to work out. Yeah. Like this? Uh, I probably would like it if it shot like at the very start. It's not even working the way I want it to. Oh, we have 2-2-2 two, two, uh, two glue. What if I... Uh, um, Perishing potions and then 2-0-2 two, two glue this rams. Let's see. Yeah, this is good. Glue it really early. Now, when does the glue wear off? Because I need to reapply it. Oh no, the timing. Are you guys seeing that? Let's watch again. So yeah, unfortunately, it's exactly so that um, they regrow. No, no, no. Here's the problem: the corrosive glue isn't strong enough to stop the regrow farm. Hell, even corrosive and uh, um, stronger acid isn't fast enough. All right, we gotta try attack shooter. How good is a alk buffed two zero two? I doubt it's good enough, but we gotta try. Something. Yo, this is good. We win. We win. Damn. 2 2 attack is nice. Well, GG, I guess. Alright, round 28, boys. Round 28. So it's probably one of those counters where there's no lead and you have to find a way to win. Oof, that's a lot of modifiers. Alright. Also, you only have $3,000. That's rough. It is a 15% win rate, but you click here. So on average, uh, it took people 15 attempts, at least, to beat this. Well, let's see what is uh, lead damage for cheap. Lightning Druid. Like, maybe I glue the leads, and then thing? 101 glue. Oh, it's camo, right. Frick, um, restart. My D camo is the shimmer. Okay, so I'd shimmer, and then I would... Mm, I would, uh, get the freaking druid. But first, I would glue soak. Hell, I'll even do this. Uh, sell that for 102. Crap. Let me just wait. So the money isn't there, unfortunately. So hear me out on this, this attempt. So I won't buy uh, 102. Please stop missing. I swear. So sell this now. I will buy 101 now. Get Druid to this guy. And then sell it once I... Uh, come on. I need glue on the 6. And then sell for lightning and then I win. Well, not that easy because the boons are fast. And I die. Right, right, right. Okay. I only have one druid, but this is basically the answer. I just don't know if I need glue. Yeah, why were the blue the balloons not all glued? I had glue soap on them. Did I like mess up somewhere? Oh, I know why. I think I might have messed up because uh some of the glue that I applied was stronger sticky glue, so it didn't reapply at the right time, so it timed out or something. Let's try it again. Or did it only have zero zero one glue? Okay, I'll do one zero one. 1-0-1, then we win. Okay? It's that easy, boys. So, reapply everything, please. Everything, everything, everything. Oh, I can't buy it. If I go for 1-0-1, one, one, I lose. So, it has to be a 1-0-0. Zero, zero. So, please reapply glue here. It still misses. That's some BS. Fine. We'll wait here, then. 4? 
Five, six. Lightning, win. Stay glued, please. Don't time out, don't time out, don't time out. Bad timing. So I need to find a way for it to not whiff, because that's so annoying. It might be because the projectile is really thin. Try again, maybe this spot? Sounds better, yeah, this is better. A little bit further away from the balloon, so... Sell now. And then now I can reapply, right here. Beautiful. I need six. Four. Five. Six. Poggers. Hell, I could even sell the druid. Yeah, I should sell, sell the druid, sell the druid. Because once I pop the leads, I can win the rest with maybe a 0 2 glue or ice. Let me just wait again. Do this. Reapply. I need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, do that. Sell it. So we go for the ice now. Screw it. Super early ice tower. We froze all of them. And we win. Easy. Easy. That took less than the average 15 attempts on this challenge, so... I count that as a victory. I'll give it a like. It was nice. Alright, 2% win rate. Wait. Alright, I'm down to try a round 40 challenge, just, just to see. Okay, so it's max rigor rate. I would assume I can use a mauler at start. One monkey, buy resell action. So it's probably math, right? It's either 28 or 29 uh, serum HP. Let me just try this. When does this pop? Now? Sniper? Okay, 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 gotcha. I need to do like one damage to uh, everything there. These balloons are so fast, I'm not sure we have a chance against them. Like, Sniper will not get them in time. Is there any place I could get, get this guy earlier? Like here? No, I need three shots. Can I sell this in mid-flight? Yeah, I can. So you notice that we one-shot the first ceramic, but the HP is exactly such that uh, it won't work for the other three. Maybe I just drop a sub. Two damage at a time. Or a boat. Or a bomb. Okay, a base bomb might be decent for one damage. Like, watch this. Oh, I can take lives. Right, I forgot. Uh... One shot. Okay. That's good enough. Two. Wait, that was easy. Huh? I didn't even lose any lives on that challenge. But this was a 2% win rate. It took me two minutes. Death rate less than 1%. Interesting.